all four of us were thinking that let's do something exciting why don't we do a road trip from kanyakumari to kashmir why don't we go and even create a record for the same the drive was a combination of two passions uh, passion for driving and passion for csr and we thought the most uh, apt initiative to be attached with was seeing is believing i wanted to have a personal story which i could share with my children and my grandchildren before we started this journey we did shortlisting of a lot of vehicles we ultimately logged in for mahindra xuv 500 because it has a perfect balance for comfort and the ruggedness which we needed in this trip comfort because for literally 3 days it's going to be our home also the smooth drive that it provides in the city and the city driving conditions the high ground clearance was one of the important factors which we considered before choosing xuv for this particular adventure we would have the support from mahindra throughout this journey because of their widest service network that they have in india which not only covers the major cities but also the rural part of india which was there in our route in september 30th and 2013 from kanyakumari we commenced the journey in the afternoon at 2:30 all right we have left uh, kanyakumari about an hour ago music is playing and there's a great thing there's a mile post coming up please yeah clear the next 300 kilometers in the next 8 hours we were quite worried in terms of the time we had lost that's when we hit the delhi uh, agra expressway this is a stretch of about 200 kilometers almost and i floored the vehicle the vehicle ran like almost like a tank on the road we never felt uh, you know once if we hired a pair of gps tracking system from uh, one of this accredited agencies by libka those gps systems recorded our precise position as we you know climbed up the rotang pass which is the most dangerous stretch on the le manali road we also got a snowstorm uh, which hit us and the vehicle uh, heavily but as usual the vehicle was stable right throughout and we managed to maneuver through these treacherous roads effortlessly about 250 kilometers away from le the entire team was absolutely exhausted we were actually contemplating should we take a break should we sleep for a couple of hours oh god when this is going to end you know because every time we take a turn it seems to be another mountain to cross zuza had really said that no this has to be achieved in such a fashion that come what may no other team can be breaking this record unless the road conditions improve the most difficult part according to me in the journey was the last 400 kilometers of mountainous terrain which we had to cover at night and most of the people cover that uh, distance over 2 days uh, almost 48 hours and we covered it in 14 hours flat the turn assist lights were also quite useful when we were driving through pitch darkness and the mountainous terrain we reached le at 4:30 in the morning we were expecting to reach there around 9:30 10 so our first priority was to catch hold of a gazetted officer who could certify that we were actually completed the journey by 4:30 in the morning to be honest we were so fagged out that we didn't even realize that we were actually broken the record and the first thing we wanted to do is hit the bed and it wasn't till 12 hours hence post getting up that that we started getting calls from our family our friends it actually sunk in that boss we actually smashed the record that to by a span of over 10 hours it's all about your mental strength at the end of the day and not physical when you are looking for a marathon journey coming to the point of making this record again we would like to open this challenge to everyone and in case no one is able to do that you know we'll try to better it again surely we'll choose the xuv 500 again because that's the apt car for this kind of a trip it has been lucky for us in the first time 62 hours with xuv 500 has created a memorable story which we will cherish for life four colleagues who embarked upon this journey are now friends forever <laughs>